Hi, this is the tutorial for Glom Fashion Brush Set's free worksheet. Glom Fashion Brush Set features 80 brushes and 8 models. You can find the link to buy in the description below. If you are the previous buyer, please download all PNG worksheets in the link in the description below. If you are a new buyer, you can find all free worksheets in the models procreate file here. In this tutorial, we are creating an easy flowing sparkly gown using a tool brush. Let's begin. Import the PNG worksheet and place it on amber. We are using three colors and five brushes for this gown. Separate the outline into a new layer. Adjust the size to fit the model and lower the opacity to 30%. We are leaving the background white for now. Create a new layer under the outline. Let's start with the bodice first. Use the base brush and color number 1 to draw along the green line. Create a new layer on top and turn this layer into a clipping mask. Change the blending mode from normal to add. Use the color number 2 and the glitters tool gown brush with 100% opacity to paint the bodice. I'm using add instead of normal because add gives a much brighter color. Now let's group the bodice layers together. Next, move down to the skirt. We will use this very same technique for the skirt too. I divided the skirt into four parts here. Each part will be on a different layer. Let's start with the number one piece. Create a new layer. Use the base brush and the color number one to draw on the first piece. Create a clipping mask layer on top and change this to add. Use the tool brush and the color number 2 with 100% opacity to draw. You can make a small twist at the end of the skirt so it looks like it is flowing. Let's group this together. Next, create a new layer under the first piece. Draw the base layer with the base brush and the color number 1. I want to make this layer a bit darker so lower the tool brush opacity down to 70%. Draw in a vertical direction. Draw the third piece under the second piece. Match the tool direction to the curvy shape of the piece. Next, for the fourth piece, we are drawing this layer under the body layer of amber. Use 100% opacity on this piece. But for this one, it is the inside part of the skirt, so it has to look darker. So lower the opacity to 30% and draw. Let's turn off the underwear layer. Then create a new layer to draw the shoes. Next fill the background with the background color. Let's brighten Amber's hair color a little. Go to Adjustment and select Hue Saturation. Adjust the color you like. Now, we are adding more shine to the gown. First, 
Create a new layer on top of all layers. Change the blending mode to add. Use the smooth crease brush, middle size, 70% opacity, and the color number 2. Lightly paint where you want extra highlights by following the tool lines. Create another add layer on top. Use the sparkle brush at 100% opacity. Tap on the highlight areas. Go back to the first highlight layer. Use the soft brush at 70% opacity to emphasize on only a few spots to make the gown looks more glowing. Lastly, draw a shadow beneath the model. Create a new layer on top of the background and make this layer multiply. Draw an oval shape with the background color. Use motion blur at 35% to make the shadow softer. And that's finished. You can explore more textures using the different tool brushes. Thank you for watching the video. I hope this tutorial can be helpful for you. Please like, share and subscribe, thanks.